Yo, what is up guys? Stix is Elfie here. Today, I'm, you know, I haven't put out, like, a video in a while. So I just decided I was gonna, you know, go ahead and let her know you. Um, I entered a tournament and, well, I was using Agamadel before. But now that it's banned, I kinda need to build some new teams. So, you know, this'll be just me testing out some stuff. And this team right here with a uh, Mega Aerodactyl and uh, Specs Lele. And we have this game against Blaze Cephalon and Megaloth and the Nucleus score. So, um, where do I lead? I'm just gonna leave Flanders. It's a very nice lead. I get my rocks up at the very least. I still probably leech Cedar Spikes. It won't matter too much, but now that I'm looking at it, this team actually struggles quite a bit with their thorn. I'll probably have to burn it with Gengar. Huh. This man up with the timer. Dude. Um, I'll just go ahead and show you the team. I'll probably I might edit it during like live. I use these two because they have like similar checks, so I figured they could break them down. Uh, Keldia for like Greninja check. Um, Landers because I needed a rocker. I wanted something to disrupt like balance with that Lewis. And just a cleaner. Um, I don't think the team is very good at all, but I'm gonna work with it for a little bit. It's actually getting spikes up, which is quite problematic. But I can just Wisp. And. He actually knocks me off. That's quite annoying. But that's a 30. With, uh... Yeah, that's a lot. Because that's a 30 without the boost. And I'm not... I'm like max HP, I believe. Yeah. So, he really has to be wary. I don't think the crit mattered because Hex is uh, double the amount of damage. But he will go up. I'll just go to Landris. And then. Um, maybe Cortana? I really want to get rid of Blaze first. I don't think. <laughs> I don't like using Scarf Cortana. I don't know. But it's here. Put it up with it. Um, what do I really need Landris for? I guess this. So let's just weaken it for now. I can bring Ma uh, Mega Arrow in. Um, get some damage off. Whatever wants to come in. Maybe it'll be Clef. I'm not sure. Uh <clears throat> Um, so how's it going, guys? Um, so, last week, or this week, I don't know why I'll upload this. Um, I uploaded quite a bit early into the week, and then, you know, I kind of stopped towards the end. But, I won't be, like, so generous with the uploads, because I just had Thanksgiving break off, so, you know, it was a good time for me. But now that that's, uh, at an end, I'll be back to, you know, going to school and such. So, um, you guys can expect, um, less uploads, but, you know, you just gotta deal with it. Um, what's gonna come in? Which one's a Scarfer? One of these two has to be a Scarfer, right? Yeah, this is just too slow. Um, yeah, get rid of that. So it goes to the Parathorn. And... Get the Aerial Ace. Maybe he'll Gyro, but... No, he'll just seed. That's fine. Just now I can go ahead and... Get a Calm Mind up. And I can Secret Sword. As he goes to the Clef. And... I hope you're ready for this Hydro Vortex. Bless. Alright. 
Alright, he's definitely Scarf on this. So, whether he goes for the Psychic or the Moon Blast. Fast is Blaze. I think Blaze is also a pretty bad mod. Blaze It's such a weird name. Blaze Sathalon. Um, Elkeldeo is faster, so it'll be useful against both the Parathorn and the Blaze. While Arrow, I think I can sack it with no problem at all. Actually, lives. Let's see if he's up. Yeah, he is definitely Scarf. Now it's my turn to just bring in the uh, Lele and Psychic. Oop. And, you know. Okay, I'll be, that's fine. Huh, I feel like that lasted a very long time. Now, never mind. Yeah, this is the last turn for sure. I was about to say, I think that <laughs> the Psychic train lasted for a bit too long. Anyways. At this point, I'm just gonna click Smart Strike. As uh, I should have put, I should have used uh, Sacred Sword. I knew that was gonna happen. Um, I'm gonna put myself into a really bad position now. Huh. All right. Okay, that's down. So, I don't need to worry about that. That Blaze comes in. And I don't know if he's like double scarf, but if it's double scarf. No. Alright. GG. Uh, that was a good first game. I felt like I could play that end a bit better, but. You know. Just gotta deal with it. And I can just finish it off with Smart Strike. Alright. That's game one. I think Mega Arrow is like, really cool. And, oh god. This looks terrible. I don't want to play against this. Uh, Alright. What do they usually run? Roar Veil. Or Moon Blast Blizzard? I'm not sure. Which is... Do I want to take a Moon Blast? This, I thought he might have led a Spirit Old, but apparently not. So he just gets up his Veil. That's fine. Yes, he has a Beware, too. That's nuts. Um... See, he's expected the smart strike, so I'll go ahead and I'll leaf with the slow bro. Nowhere. Lando time. Lando should be a good switch in. Get some rocks up too. He just bulks. Bulks. Eh. Use his bulk up. And. I'm going to keep Landorus around. Well, that's not happening. Uh, well, I can still keep it around. Now, he might play around. I don't think Landers is worth it. I got my rocks up, which is why I wanted. Because now, I can... See if we go to top of the way, like, I can click Spec Smooth Blast. Um, I should deal, like, a chunk of damage to pretty much his entire team. This top of the whale we're talking about. <sighs> and, um, just get back to the uploads. Um, with the uploads, uh, I'm definitely gonna be putting out more stuff out there. I'll be putting out, like, some Mega Man Maker, some. Some more mods with like the squad, of course. Uh, F E will still be going up. I might do Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. I'm not entirely sure. 
Like, the audio with the VBA keeps all the gate all screwy for some reason. I've never had this problem before. And it's just odd because I can't seem to fix it. So, if any of you guys know how to fix that problem, then go ahead and tell me. And this guy needs to be hit up with that tonight. Um, what else do I got? I have also gonna play my uploads of Hearthstone. I like playing it, but first of all, I just kind of started recently, and second of all, I'm not that good at it. Um, I'm gonna go to Slowbro, so I can go ahead and... Okay, that's good. I can Wisp whatever wants to come in, whether it be like Pins or Bisharp. It's predict, yeah. Oh man. Oh, pff, I'm stupid. Psychic turn is up. I'm retarded. All right. All right. Ugh. Okay, I messed that up terribly. Uh, Gengar would have put a lot of pressure on his team. So now I just have to leap way my way to victory. Has he a uh, fire blast too? Oh, that's a dude. You'll see fire blast often. <laughs> As I go back into Lele and I'm poking moon blast. Okay, but at the very least, uh, Kelly answers are looking kind of thin now. As what I go for sucker Ironhead. Yeah, I figured. I figured he'd sucker punch. He kind of seems like the person that would forget that works. Uh, I'm not only predicting the moves, but I'm predicting how my opponent reacts to the game. Uh, that's fine. People forget mechanics. I forget that Prankster uh, doesn't work on dark types literally all the time. As he just uh, returns, that's fine. Nothing wants to, well, nothing wants to come in on the stone edge. So I just have to pick a god and pray I hit. Bless. All right, this game should be won. The only thing I'm sort of afraid now is missing. This is why we have Kalk. So there's a spear goal. I'm just gonna assume. Yeah, it's like that. Then arrow. Arrow mega. Where's that carry always? Wind attack, whatever. Yep. Hey. Hey. Double kill. There we go. And I can't see GG yet because I might miss the edge. He might have me blast too. So, pray. Okay, yeah, GG. So far, this thing looking kind of clean. You know, I'm not a huge fan of using Scarf Partana, but, you know, it's working out. Okay, we got this hella annoyed team right here. We got a switch hits for Lele, which is pretty bad. <laughs> I just play around with it, especially if it's Scarf. Scarf kind of terrorizes this team. Alright. And the cell steel is really annoying too, but that's why I have T-Bolt on a Gar. Anyways, I kinda feel he'll lead Zard. So I'll just go ahead and lead Yeah. Um No reason for me not to click Stone Edge. I get that oh my god! <laughs> Damn, look at that power! Look at that power. I kinda feel that it's defensive too. Yeah, that was... Okay, what a shame, what a damn shame, but... You know what? We have to move on. Question is, what is he gonna do now? I think what I do... Is, I do something like this, and then I U-turn, right? Yeah, I U-turn out. I go back into that arrow. And I take another life. Oh man, that is not a good start for him. 
I could go to Gar as he actually ends up seeding. That's fine. Go to kill Dio now. Quick the combine. Um, I could have cooked. I should have put taunt, but whatever. I called out again as uh, he sub. Okay, that's interesting. That's very annoying. I don't like that. <laughs> Can he not? Uh, bless. Stop the weapon, man. All right, I just didn't do that. And I can wisp. And then, I can wisp again. Or I can T-bolt, in case he goes out to Zard. Yeah, that's why I like the C, you know. I gotta make the plays. I gotta make this work. Boom. Out of my way. This goes to Gar. I have LDO for that. So I ain't too worried. Unless he pulls out the extra sensory, but he actually doubles out to Coco. So, kudos to him. It powers, that's fine. arrow and I click edge again. Or I can go to uh Yeah, that's why I like the C. That's why I like the C. Now I click that Hydro Vortex. And nothing coming in on this. Coco, that's gone. That's destroyed. Absolutely demolished. All right. Now we go to Cartana. We just burned it out. I think I stay with Cartana this time because he might predict me to switch out. As a psychic actually kills. Okay. Okay. And he's life orb too. So. Huh. Life orb. Makes it a bit less threatening. I have to hit the edge. Do I have to hit the edge? Oh, uh, wait, wait. Yeah, I have to hit the edge. Is the edge even kill? Whoa. It's disgusting. Um, okay. Is it a T-Bolt? No, oh, that's fine. Landers is actually doing Jack. He ain't getting the seeds up. And then I can hydro blast that away. Hydro again. Boom. Now, pushes. A hydro. No doubt about it. As now he's in a pretty, pretty bad position. He's in a position where Moon Blast literally just wins. Less. All right. He goes in his own play lay, and Landris, once again, I've already said it does Jack. And we go to Big Arrow, and Wind Attack does if not kill. Boom, easy. And it's my way late. Um, at the edge. Oh, crap. I might lose now. This might just kill. Okay, bless. Alright. Alright. That end game there. It's kind of shaky. The Cell of Steel really uh, dark my team. I think I'll put a, like, T-Bolt on a Lele instead. Well, the Steel types in general just kind of harass this team. Anyways. We got the god in front of us. We have Stack Attack, our Lord and Savior. Um, I feel like he'll lead Landris, so I'll just go ahead and lead Keldeo, as I guess we both have the same thought process. <laughs> oh man, of 
question is, what set would he be? Um, he turned, he turned sleepy mega. Um, stack attack is probably the Z, Z move user, so Kikita is probably EV, Keldeo is probably Specs or Scarf. If it looks too light of Caldeo, it has to be Specs. Uh, that's just how I would lead. So, the question is, I don't know what Caldeo, but what do I switch out into? Okay, that works, I guess. Um, I didn't really know what else to do there. As this team doesn't want to come in on Smart Strike, as he's actually Mega Latios. Ah, huh, that's interesting. But he's just gonna drop that Draco. As, um, this gives me free rain, then just bring in Arrow. Get my Mega Evolution on. And, I can Edge. I don't want to use Edge because there's the potential of missing. But, I just wanted to use it in case Landers wanted to come in. Now I just bring in my own. And, oh, he does have a defogger, unless this is also his defogger, which I'm trying to see this unlikely, but I'll just HP Ice. Um, now I can rocks, because, or, or that could just kill, alright, yeah, I should have seen that coming. <laughs> uh, but I think he is in range for, you know, who Mega Aerodactyl that just come in and finish it off. As uh, this brings in Bagirda, or prompts Bagirda to come in. So, I think it's my time to just go to Keldeo and. where he might. Yeah, I'll just go Keldeo. As he stays in the DQs, that's kind of an odd play. I would have got Bagirda there, as I guess he's just getting rid of the Landers. I guess I saw it didn't do much afterwards. And I really want to keep Keldeo alive because there's just. Literates these two and Hydro Vortex is the other. But I'm looking like there, uh, there's no options here. It's like Lele, I guess. As he misses, bless, alright. As he's gonna get the trick buff now, that's really, really scary. Oof, but we get the mega damage hit. Now I go to Keldeo. I live this- okay, I don't live that gyro. I was gonna say we live the gyro, but we don't because it's literally stack attack and stack attack a this god. Yeah, GG. Oh man. Stack attack is so threatening. You guys should see that squad assault, man. If you, if you haven't seen it yet, of course. Uh, this, a bright powder. Reveal bright powder. Alright, yeah. And he's gonna hit us up with that Rocky MZ. You know, gotta roll with that more, just saying. Anyways, we have one more game. And we're kinda in, like, close to 20. Uh, we're like, almost at 24 minutes. As we're facing this Jake ass team, like, what the hell is this? It has a Ditto, a Mega Gallade, and a Blaze, and a Shuffle. This team just looks all kinds of black. Anyways, uh, this seems to be our uh, favorite matchup of the day. Huh. Wonder. I would just let Shuckle fire him, I guess. The Shuckle is sturdy, and it just lived anyways, it got the webs up. But, I guess not. So, I think I'll just, uh. Jeez, what set would he be? He would just be like Specs, right? I actually get the Calmind there. Bless for the bad play, am I right? Bad plays always win. And so we'll just go to uh, Ditto next. Uh, yeah, he goes to Ditto, but that doesn't matter. That won't matter. As I can just go to Gengar. I get my free sub now. And it's just time to harass the team. Let's see, I have to be the Keldeo. Um, yeah. Let's 
hex it up. Switch is the blaze that's gone. Uh, it gets rocks up. They ain't do it much. Okay, that's sort of bad. That's not great, but it's like whatever. Um, so my chance to get rid of these uh, sticky webs is on the Ditto, which will hopefully copy a terrible mod. Hopefully. Something like a defog on. So maybe. Oh, that's just so bad. Uh, okay. Okay, let's see. You can just hex now. And so I'll go ahead and heat wave. That's fine. I get the crit. That crit mattered. Crit mattered. Alright. The once I defog, I get the clear. Um, did I take rocks damage? I felt like... Um, huh. Oh, I got confused. That's what happened. I was wondering, like, I only took 95. I shouldn't be dying out here, but... You know, things happen. Anyways, not much on this team wants to take the aerial ace besides the ditto, which is what I'm looking for. Um, yeah. Because... I really hope my prediction is right in that he's specs. Okay, bless. That's gone. He's going to his own arrow, finally. Finally. And I can win this game if the web's up. But my question is, what do I need to sack here? Lele isn't gonna do much, so... Um, sacking Lele is the best. Great. I get my defog off. As long as it doesn't like crit, or you know, if it's not actually scarf, which is entirely possible. But yeah, that happens. That's good. We are in here. And Landers also does nothing for the most part. So see, this one is so weak. I I don't care. Its name is also so odd. I don't. I don't need it, the name is. Why does it have 127 attack? Hello? Who is gonna use that attack and what moves does it get to use it? Oh man. Anyways, he gets his plus one special attack, which is fine. It's like, whatever. And I'm sure EQ just kills Blaze. Right? Blaze Cephalon. Yeah, EQ definitely kills it. Hell, Aerial Ace might even kill it. But we ain't looking out for that here in a way, so I'm just clicking here. We got nothing to worry about. Now the, the blaze is gone. We can sit out, you know. It's entirely fine. We'll probably click edge. As I predicted. Yeah. Edge is just a reasonable play. And I can click secret sword really. And so go to go late. Um, I was thinking about, you know, just clicking my Z move there, but we don't need to. Ace. And no matter what he does, he's in checkmate pretty much. Um, unless if I hit, like, an unlucky miss. Huh. Wait, I can still do this. Um, we go to this. I can still lose this, technically. Just Sacred Sword. Now, oh my gosh, I might have choked this way. Never mind. We get those speed ties because you know we're the true go out here. And now to be a wrap. Um, if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Hasta luego.